Hey everyone, it's Russ from recordproduction.com and today we're looking at three tips, mistakes not to make when you're recording vocal and acoustic guitar. So I'm at the wonderful Catalyst Studios in the northwest of England in St. Helens. I've got a Zoom recorder, it's an H4N and H4N Pro and uh, the OC818 from the wonderful people at Austrian Audio. So first of all, we have to make sure we're in a nice environment and we've got our instrument in tune. The first tip, tip one, is to use headphones when setting up your mic position. Even a little pair of earbuds like this going to my digital recorder can be used to check the mic position. Just play and move the mic around, move yourself around, move your head around and uh, you'll come up with the, the perfect sound. Once you've done that, nip into your control room, wherever that is, bedroom, whatever, and uh, play back your test recordings. See if you can change anything, do a little bit of experimentation, because 15 minutes setup is gonna be really valuable, more so than trying to EQ the sound later on. So I'll do the first verse of this. Now we're going to have some baffles installed by my beautiful assistants. Okay, let's try that again with some absorbers behind me. Now, if you haven't got baffles, you can use a quilt at home, you can stand in front of uh, curtains or whatever. Gotta be optimistic Optimistic Tip three, moving the microphone to and fro to add more or less room sound. We have a mystery engineer who's flown in from LA uh, to, to do this. Um, he'll be moving the, uh, the microphone back and forward as I play.
That's three things to watch out for when you're recording acoustic guitar and vocals and you've only got one mic and a lovely studio or your bedroom. Thanks very much to our beautiful assistants uh, here at Catalyst Studios and our, our mystery hand man over there. Um, and I'll see you all next time. <laughs>